Gamers, my name is KK and today we have update number 34 uh, Not too big of an update, but we got the new boss balloon and new pretty exciting map So this map has quite a few concepts and I will show you the map today So first let's buy all the limited time items first remember I don't recommend you to buy the stuff that's not limited time because we have limited amount of the trophies and uh, Personally, I don't like the boss events that much and uh, I'm tired of grinding them so I'm just buying the limited time items because uh, they most of them are not gonna be coming back so it's a smart choice okay let's change our avatar back or not Nah, I like this one it's pretty cool and the banner <laughs> which one which one let's do the monkeys in space because it's based all right so next one is Churchill skin of course Slay Queen Churchill skin. Okay, select Churchill because reasons. Okay, now the new map. Uh, as you can see, I've been lazing around and I can't play this game enough. It's, it gets boring and repetitive, so I don't have all the maps blackboard. Oh, see, some of my friends already completed this map. All right. So, wow, the game is laggy. Holy shit! What is going on? This map has special properties, so as you can see, uh, we have primary, magic, military and support spots. So the purple is magic, orange is support and so on. Uh, we can only place, from what I understand, the specific types of uh, monkeys. So as you can see, magic doesn't fit here, but primary does fit. Uh, this one is like available for all the towers and the hitbox of these is quite good as you can see so I can at least fit four tech shooters here so let's do like this and see what comes next um, yeah this is the free zone so we can farming can be farming there all right and from what I remember okay <laughs> we got a gift and the gift is the discount so uh, Oh, I see. I don't understand why the game is lagging so fucking hard. Uh, but it's alright. We got one more gift. Oh, so the gifts go as the rounds progress. Wow. Interesting, interesting. Okay, so is this gonna be the next one or... No, no, no. Oh, I see. So when you press on these it just appears see then the next gift and this one is the popping which ones it is the support popping power for the support that's pretty darn interesting with the rounds these things change and each of those ha uh, pawns or like sections has the uh, special properties and sniper works pretty darn, darn well on this map so might as well use the snipers Okay, and the ice projectiles on the tech shooter looks pretty darn good. Okay, so this this time I'm gonna show you one of like the obscure strategies, but the it's one of the funnier ones. Uh, first, we will need to save up for the Churchangas, so the Slay Churchill, and then uh, I'm gonna do the supply drop strategy. And it's time for Churchill. Eh, might as well put it over here because his range is massive. He will reach over here too. Oh, okay. <laughs> uh, this guy looks pretty funny. Uh, nothing like the tank and the Santa Churchill we had in the past. Uh, you know what? Since we got this new weird buff, I'm gonna use the s sniper in this spot because it gives the buff. I don't know the name of the buff, but uh, my guess it's gonna give us extra popping power. Yeah, so the sniper usually 000 does 2 layers per shot, this one does three layers per shot, so pretty good, pretty good. <laughs> Churchill got his minigun and look at the, look at it, I think he's using the the crystal ball as the core and he shoots with the minigun from his <laughs> That's what you call a magic weapon. Also, look at this smug face of the Churchill, like how satisfied with everything he is. 
he he owns it okay i got my first supply dropper and the lag is real like look at this shit i don't know why it happens with bt6 quite often right after the update so when they release the first patch it gets way more stable but in the like for example this is 34.0 in all point zero versions it it gets pretty darn laggy and the churchill looks uh, he got a drip with the sunglasses and it looks pretty cool like this is probably you know one of my favorite skins so far like uh, galaxy is top tier skin and this slay churchill Two thousand years later. And the good thing about the sniper strategy is that the more snipers you have, the more it snowballs. And round 80, let's use the gifts level 10. Uh, which is not too powerful at this level against the Zomai God, but whatever. Okay, free play, let's go. We are getting level 20 Churchangas. He got a lot of drip, but he will get even more of it. You know what? I want to get the monkey town so that the snipers and range make us more monies. Yeah, because we are pretty rich as it is, but I want to maximize the profits I can squeeze from the rounds themselves. And I'm going to do the same thing over here uh, just because I can. Okay, so now we are pretty rich and I'm going to upgrade all of our snipers to... 240 because uh, I usually don't upgrade the tier 2 on those it's very good but uh, I don't upgrade it until I get to the later stages of the game because it's expensive and it's like not the best investment in the beginning but now that we are rich we can absolutely afford it okay spirit of the forest okay and I need to give him the mid village probably <laughs> do I need to Okay, now the snipers are dealing with the DDTs, no problem. It's so fucking weird. Alright. <laughs> what happened? Why? I, I don't really understand. Uh, why are the snipers became more effective? It's very, very weird. Tell me in the comments, guys. Because even before the vines reached that spot, snipers already became massively more powerful. Maybe it's because there is more balloons on the screen and the more bounces happen before the projectile dissipates. Who knows? And the Churichungus! Level 18, level 19, and the final drip, level 20. Yay! Okay, okay his drip did not change, but his uh, sledge is now purple. Uh, which is amazing. His gift bag is now white and... Okay, I'm gonna use the Churchill's ability because it's very good against the DTs. Uh, and the Druid helps us out. Okay, now, can the can this test setup destroy round 100? I'm pretty sure yes. Even though these towers are weak against the Bad Balloon, uh, since the map is quite long and we have Churchangus with his beautiful abilities, uh, I'm gonna keep on using those. Yeah, it wasn't even that difficult to be honest. And boom, we got the Insta Monkey and done. Well, what can I say? The map is very good. It's unlike the other maps <laughs> from the latest stages. Uh, it's very good. Okay, did we get the achievement? Have 70 buffs, 75 buffs active on the monkeys at once. <laughs> easy, easy. I didn't even try and I got it. <laughs> Uh, so, uh, the update is pretty good, we got the very epic skin, the map is extremely original, so Scrapyard is also pretty original with this, uh, like, RAM thingy, but 1, 2, 3 is much better, like, it's like, we need more maps like this, with the original concepts, uh, prefer preferably less lag, but still, it's very, very good. Alright guys, smash like and subscribe if you wanna, if you don't wanna, get out of here and see ya!